Ooh, that wow. was a big puddle. There's so much water everywhere. That was huge. Ooh, we should be amphibious. Oh man, this is such a bummer because it's raining, so I can't paint outside. Why don't you paint from the car? inside the car. Yeah, except with all the rain on the window, I can't see anything because of all the raindrops. The raindrops? Paint the raindrops? You mean like the view through the window with the raindrops in front? No, paint the raindrops. They're in the way. Okay, I'll paint them. Challenge accepted. Okay. I could, you know, I could use, I have this yellow underpainting and I could paint the view through the window and then the layer of glass. It's gray on gray on gray. Except yeah, for these exactly. Brake lights Might as and well. The red light in front of us. Make the most of it. Okay, so I'm going to start out by wetting the surface, and I'll just use a big flat brush. And if I have a wet surface, then I can paint the landscape that I see through the window kind of out of focus. So the big areas on the side of the road are dark, keeping it real simple, and the sky is light, and the reflection on the wet street is also pretty light. Okay, and um, by using a big brush, and as long as all these areas are wet together, I should be able to um, blend them while they're still wet because I want the focal plane to be on the window, not on the landscape. Okay, light sky. And flat brushes are good for this. I'm using not uh, just black and white, but also some ultramarine blue and some light red and some yellow ochre so I can get a little bit of warm and cool. Okay, now I can put in kind of a little dark splotch for a car in front of us. And then I can kind of rub it back out to yellow with a wet rag. I just dampen the corner of a cotton rag. I can lift off, uh, I lift it a little too much, lift off some of that casein. Okay, now, um, let's put a windshield wiper on here. That'll make it look like I'm inside a car, not just a regular window. It has those little spanners, and then the rubber part in contact with the window. And then I can put in the dashboard it's just one dark shape at the bottom. Now, okay, the brush that I'm using for the droplets is a long, thin brush. The top of each droplet reflects the sky. The bottom, like an inverted lens, reflects the street, and the sides are dark because they reflect those side dark masses. It's kind of neat because raindrops on a window are a good metaphor for our lives. We arrive single and alone and small, but only once we join with others do we begin to move, to travel. And so, in a way, our lives play out on the boundary layer. That glass is like a boundary layer between the inside of the car, like our inner thoughts, and the outside of the world, the world of chaos and phenomenology around us. This long brush, and I can also use a uh, use this colored pencil to finish it up. Raining harder. Okay. All right. So there we go. Finished. All done. <laughs> 